What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another one of my videos. Today I'm actually be showing you guys my favorite class setup for actually one of my favorite guns in Call of Duty Modern Warfare, the M4A1. Now I'm actually going to end up posting uh, the actual class setup on the screen in a little bit. But uh, you know guys, feel free to actually pause the screen, take a picture of it, you know, actually make the class yourself. Or just keep listening to me talking um, because I'm actually going to explain to you why I have what I have on the gun. As well as um, the lethals, anything like that. Especially the perks, those are actually pretty important to me. Um, and uh, I'll just talk to you guys about basically what you can uh, alternate it with if there's something that you want to change. So here you guys have it. This is actually the class that I am using in this actual video. Uh, now before I even actually explain anything else, I just want to say that this is more of an uh, AR aggressive you know, rushing around, actually moving type of class. This isn't a type of class where you're going to want to camp in a window and basically wait for the other team to get to you. Um, with this class, you're literally just running around nonstop. You guys are noticing this gameplay, actually. I hardly ever stop in one specific spot. I'm always moving around, jumping, looking in different corners, uh, rushing the other side of the map. So you guys are going to notice I actually do that a lot. Uh, so this is the type of class you are going to be using for that kind of stuff. So I just want to put it out there. Uh, if you guys are looking for another class setup where you're basically kind of just chilling back, you know, hanging, not as aggressive, um, just let me know in the comment section below. I'll be more than happy to actually um, find another class setup for you guys too. Now, for starters, you guys are actually going to realize that my main perks are actually EOD, Hardline, and Battle Harden. Uh, for the secondary, not so much important. I actually have the 1911 pistol. Uh, this is something you guys can change uh, depending on how you play, whatever your favorite pistol is. You guys want to put a rocket launch or anything like that. Um, that's up to you guys. That's why I, didn't, I don't really want to put too much emphasis on the secondary because it isn't really too much important on the class. Um, like I said, I just kind of have a uh, secondary pistol just in case if I do run out of pistol, uh, ammo on the M4A1 just because I do find that I actually do run out of ammo sometimes. Uh, so it's kind of there just for emergencies only. Now, personally, my most important part of the class setup is these perks, just because I do feel like you could probably use this on many class setups, especially in public match, just because that's kind of how I base them on. So, for starters, I told you guys I had EOD, which is basically, in past games, it's a blast shield. Uh, somebody throws a grenade at you if something blows up near you. Um, basically, you're not going to die. You are going to take damage, but it is going to keep you from, um, from getting blown up. Uh, my next perk is actually Hardline. You guys know what this is. It's actually in, it's been in past Call of Duties. Uh, it helps you get your score streaks, kill streaks, whatever you guys want to call them, uh, and one last skill. So I know Chopper Gun, I believe, is 11 in this game. Uh, in 10, you'll get it. So that's pretty uh, self-explanatory, and um, it is gonna help you guys pop stop a little bit more, especially getting your streaks. Uh, they are pretty important in this game, especially since streaks are, streaks are actually pretty good. Now for my third perk, I do have Battle Hardened. Um, this is basically to help against flash and stuns and anything like that. The only reason I do have this on is because I do have um, an intention of actually getting flashed in public matches. That's just how it gets played. Um, I actually did have amped on before this. Um, so you guys can kind of switch between amp and battle, uh, battle hardened for your third perk. Um, amp is actually just um, helps you um switch guns and basically pick anything up faster uh i did just pick the, the battle hardened um because you really do get stunned and aided a lot in this game which is also why I, I do have the eod um so this is actually a really important perk like i said you guys can basically use these for any class setup as long as it's in pubs because they are pretty general and uh most of the class setups will actually work with these so the last part of any class setup, as you guys know, is always the lethal and the tactical. Uh, as you guys just saw, I actually do have just a regular frag grenade and a flash grenade on this class setup. Like I said, this is more of a aggressive playing class. Uh, I mean, you could put a claymore, you could put C4, anything like that. But, uh, you know, you got to kind of be trying to hold down a position like that. And that's not exactly what this class is for. Um, you know, flag the frag, not the flag, and the flash grenade. I like to throw it in if I think there's somebody in a building, it'll roll around, stun them, and I can jump in around the corner and get the kill. Uh, like I said, you can use a claymore. That's more for kind of playing back, camping, in my opinion. And I just don't like seeing those in public match. So I don't want to suggest you guys using those just because I know that for me, honestly, they ruin the game a little bit. So 
there you guys have it. That's my M4A1 public class. If you guys enjoyed the video, please remember to like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on my social media links down in the description below. If you guys have any suggestions, any questions, any comments, please leave them down below. I'm going to answer every single thing. And I will see you guys on the next video. Peace out, guys.